I saw exactly what I've always felt about Donnie Weeboy. And I saw that girl can't protect her child. Margaret Jimmy is her boy. He's your grandson. Diane Lane and Kevin Costner star in Let Him Go. It's about a couple of grandparents who find that their grandson has been taken somewhere and they're not sure where. This film is only in theaters, and it depends upon the build as a suspense film. So I asked Diane to comment on that. We go way back, Patrick. It's good to see you again. Nobody's going to believe it's way back when they're looking at you, Diane. So just don't, don't. I know the truth of that, but <laughs> Frank, it's quite irritating. Talk about the importance of preparing people with a build of a character so that after that, you can just feel what's going to happen. Yes, that's a very intelligent question. I'll try to answer it as intelligently as you asked it. Um, I, I think it's really up to, well, it has to be in the material, obviously. Yeah. As we all know, if it's not on the page, it's not going to get to the stage. You can work your tailbone off trying to infuse things that aren't there. But if there isn't pause given to emphasize that with the editor and the music and the angle and the time on the set to make sure you have the angle. And so it's such a team sport making a movie. It really, really is. Mr. Costner, sir. It's good Hello, to Patrick. See Let me just start off by saying, every time I read a script, I hope magic happens. And too mm. often it doesn't. And when I read the script, I, I saw it I saw it building in a way that, that I, I didn't expect. And, and while it's not giving away, you, you suddenly understand, most men will understand, this is going to a bad place and understand it early, understand it early. And it doesn't take away from where the movie ends up. Um, and, and, you know, the power, the charisma of a woman who takes a man where he knows that neither one of them should be going was so deftly handled in the writing. And so uh, that's what I, I saw. I, you know, there's so many times when you want to say, as a man, we were ethically entitled, morally, whatever, but we're wrong. This is taking us to a, 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 a place. And in today's film, I feel like this has a very authentic voice. Thank you, Kevin. Appreciate it. Good to see you. Exactly. Flicks with Patrick Stoner explores the craft and culture of filmmaking that enhance our communities for television stations and websites around the country. I'm Patrick Stoner. Watch more interviews by subscribing to WHYY.